I licked the toad. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode of Feed the Beast Infinity. Wow, I am so wired right now. Check me out. <laughs> How are you guys doing? I hope you're doing excellent. I am doing awesome myself. I've been up to some things, and I have plenty to show you. First, I think... I will come down here. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'll do. This is the first thing you'll want to see, right? Maybe? A bunch of cobblestone? No. <laughs> if you look right here, we've got nothing. No, seriously. I've got a harvester here. Oh, man, I'm getting low on power again. Hmm, okay. But I will crack this open. You can see I've got a bunch of these orberry bushes in here. No organization whatsoever. Nah, just kind of threw them in here. Didn't, didn't really care. Gets the job done. Right? Are you going to disappear? Maybe. Maybe not. I've got this increase radius by 11 in here. Thought it was working. Oh well, I'll fix that later. Ow, ow, ow. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Screw it. Doesn't matter. <laughs> anyway, Harvester grabs him, puts it in this chest. Okay? I've got gold and aluminum coming up here being smelted because you can't just mix them to, to make a, an ingot. And then I've got this side, if I can get to it, this side is the tin which goes into the auto bench which makes that and then pops up into a chest up there. And then I've got iron and over there I've got yeah, copper. So I've been getting quite a bit of stuff off of them. If we look in here, I mean we've got blocks of tin, uh, where is yeah blocks of iron blocks of gold blocks of copper we've got quite a bit and plus we're getting this right here which is awesome and that reminds me I want to put that just so I'll have some kind of protection on it there we go yep sweet so I said in the previous episode that we were going to do some exploring in this one perhaps but to do that, I'm going to need a few things. I need... Mm, I need a jetpack, right? Yes. We could make this tier zero, which is pretty weak. But why not jump up... Oh, tier 9001. It's over 9000! Okay. Let's go ahead and make this tier one leadstone. So I'm going to need this stuff for the leadstone jetpack lead uh, leadstone flux which is copper lead redstone and sulfur and let's see this leather strap which is just some iron and leather and what's the difference between this one and this one ah the armor oh okay so we'll need iron armor plating too which is just iron in the middle like that with tin in the corners oh so we will have some armor because you have to put it in a chest slot and then we're going to need two of these which is lead copper gear glass couple steam dynamos which is copper redstone copper gears redstone transmission coil do, 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 do. what else do we need and pneumatic servo, iron, redstone, glass, pretty easy for that. And yeah, we should be able to make that. And I think I have all the materials right here. Oh, yeah, I was going to make something else too to make it even easier. So let's look up, let's see, Tinkers. Do, 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 where are you? There are you. Ah, right here. We've got goggles which gives you a zoom and toggle abilities G I'm not sure 
what kind of abilities it's talking about, but we'll find out. And then we've got this, which makes us swim faster. It's just some leather, aluminum, wool. We've got these wings that gives us a higher jump. Gold, bronze, and an ender pearl. And let's see, we've got these high step traveler's boots, leather, aluminum, string. And then this traveler's glove, which is a bunch of leather. And I think we can enchant this, and it will affect everything that we have equipped. Maybe. And this swap hot, hot bar, I'm not too concerned about that. So I won't make that. Don't really need it. Okay, so I'm going to make all of these and the jetpack. And... Yeah, that's it. And I'll be back with you after I do all this fun stuff. Hey guys, we're back, and I've got some stuff made here. We got our jetpack ready to go, and I also made this leadstone flux pack so we can recharge while we're out there. I think I can recharge my jetpack with that, hopefully. I also had to make this energetic infuser to charge it with. And let me look that up so we know how to make it. Pretty simple, redstone transmission coils, two of those with silver, uh, redstone reception co coil with gold and redstone, two copper gears, machine frame, and another leadstone energy cell. Pretty easy to make that. And then you just stick it in here and it charges it up for you. I'm not going to use the wings because that takes up chest slot, didn't realize that. And the vest and all that takes up armor slots. So we're not going to use those. But we are going to use the boots just because we get the high step. And that's pretty awesome. The glove doesn't use up a slot, an armor slot. It uses this slot right here. And I've just enchanted it with haste. So all of my tools should be faster. Let me see. Uh, that might be a little bit faster. I can't really tell. Oh, also, I've been using this golden bag of holding while mining. So, so much better. And it's pretty easy to make, too. Let's see, where are you? Uh -huh. Just a diamond, wool, gold ingots, block of gold, and a chest. That's all it takes. Then you got this one right here which I don't think I can make these yet. Mm, possibly. Enchanted books, bookshelf. Well, I might be able to make that, actually. Hmm. But I think that would make it so that I don't lose my items. Maybe. Reincarnating. Who knows? I'll get into that later. But yeah, this thing is so sweet. Look at that. That's a full chest right there you can carry inside of that thing. So I've been using that while mining and that's been helping me out a lot. These goggles, not going to use those. The zoom is a little weird. Like I have to hit the button several times to get it to do anything. I mean, and then to get it to unzoom, it's, it's a little weird. It's not working like it should. There it goes. So I'm just not going to work with that. And abilities doesn't do anything. So I don't know if I need to enchant that. But eh, I'm not going to use it. Because it takes up another armor slot. So we're not going to worry about that. We'll just stick that in here. And let's see. I've got a sleeping bag so I can sleep at night. Plenty of food. And I got my glider so I can save on some juice with my jetpack. Just fly up and then glide down. And then I'll take all of this. Leave that one out. Put all of this in here. Just save some space. I'm going to bring some buckets with me in case I find some liquids I want to pick up. Yeah. Cool. Now... 
going to show you guys what I've been working on up top. You see this glass here? Ah. Oh yeah, I got this uh, nice little handy elevator here too. This, oh my god, that's so sweet. This, uh, yeah, that's awesome. This little mountain here, I've been bringing it down. I was going to bring it all the way down, but then I saw, whoa, hello. Look at this guy. Hello, slime. I s oh yeah, you see those particles? I've got decay one on here, so it's like poisoning him pretty much. Let's see. Not gonna be enough to kill him. That might kill him. Boink. Let's see how much damage that does. Uh, one more. Yep. Yeah. So that decay is pretty, pretty nice, pretty handy. Yeah. Come on. Gotcha. Awesome. Yeah, so I was going to level it down completely just so I can fix this up over here. But then I saw this water source in it. So, you know, I think I'm just, I might drop this down one more level and bring the water down some. But then over here, I'll grass it up and then I might bring it back a little bit and then just shape it on this side. Who knows? Whatever hits me, you know? Whatever I feel like doing at the time. But let's go over here. This is awesome. Oh, yeah. One more thing. Check this out. So that's the glass you saw. Now this is going to tie into what my base is going to be. It's going to affect the entire village. Because I've got these like open caves up under the village. And I was wondering what I was going to do with it, but now I know. I haven't started on it yet. What am I doing, man? <laughs> I keep forgetting I've got a jetpack now. But check. Whoa, those things. Those things grow more. Holy crap. I did not know that. These berry bushes, I had like one or two in each spot and they've grown a lot. I didn't know they were going to get that tall. Hmm. But this is what the path is looking like now. Oh yeah, and this one right here, I was wondering what I was going to do with it. So I opened this up, found a big wall right here, broke through the wall, and realized the rest of the house is right here, leading to nowhere. So, that will be something else I'll fix. I'll change that wall and I'll fix this whole house up put the entrance right here maybe a little gravel path going up this way man that sucks that these expand like that I didn't know they were going to do that I thought they were just going to be bushes yeah look at them growing hmm I wonder if I could stop that with some string or something maybe that's worth checking out Actually, I should have left that one. This one I'll take. Might leave those. This one, you're way too tall. Uh -huh. uh. Yeah. And then these are too tall. These uh, boots are kind of weird here. <laughs> That's a little bit better. As you can see, I've already gone down to 87% in this jetpack, so the power doesn't last very long at all, so it's a good thing I've got this glider. Oh, that looks a little bit better. I think these need to come down a little bit more. But that's what it's looking like right now. I think it looks pretty good. I went ahead and did some uh, half slabs right here. And let's see. I already showed you the mountain. Put some bushes all over the place. I think that looks pretty good. Put the uh, the glass on the other side. I'm gonna do that with a lot of these villages or these a lot of these buildings. I mean, so they'll have like pieces of these buildings destroyed and replaced with that glass. And once I build my base, it'll all make sense. 
Oh man, I'm so excited. It's, it's going to look awesome. But now I'm going to do some exploring. Let's look at the map here. Ooh, let's see. Which way to go? Hmm. So we got a desert over there. I'm thinking of going this direction. Um, or maybe it was a. Oh yeah, you'll see. I kind of died over here. There was a. Uh, what's it called? I don't even remember what the mod is called now. Anyway, there's a big demon-looking thing came out after me and killed me. So that sucked. This one over here was just a careless mistake. <laughs> uh, I dug up straight up. I knew I shouldn't, but I was, I risked it and I died. Idiot. I'm gonna go check this out. I'm gonna see what this looks like. Uh -huh. I'm not gonna keep you guys with me because it's gonna be a lot of traveling. Oh, I love this sleeping bag too. This is another thing that needs to be in vanilla. That these tools, especially this freaking hammer here, that definitely needs to be. And this one right here, because you can combine a shovel, axe, and a hoe. All in one. Man, that would free up so much space. But anyway, I'm gonna go, which way was that? Screw it, I'm just gonna go this way, because that looks pretty sweet over there. But if I find anything interesting, I'll come back with you guys. So, I'll be back in a bit. Okay guys, so I found this pretty sweet mountain right here. Not too far away. Well, a little bit. <laughs> but over here, you got these guys having some kind of a ritual. Check them out. They're like sucking energy out of that stone, it looks like. Hmm, what would happen if I shot one? I don't know, man. I'm kind of afraid to. Oh, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. What? How am I not hitting any of them? Do they have a force field? No. Okay. Yeah. He didn't do anything. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, that's one. I'm gonna kill all these guys. The arrows are a little funny in this mod pack. It seems like... Boink. 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 Really? Boink. Oh, there's a bunch of them over there. <laughs> it's kinda sailing to the right. And... Oh, you just pushed the other guy off. Disposable troops, huh? Well, this is going to take a while. Good thing I have an infinity bow. Screw that. Oh, wait. I don't. Yeah, I do. Infinity one. <laughs> okay. Huh. I wonder if he dropped anything worthwhile. Oh, man. This is going to suck. I'm just going to do a... Just gonna do a flyby just to see. Don't kill me, 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 don't kill me. Oh, they were coming. <laughs> they were coming. Man, this jetpack is kinda weak. Aha, you can't get me over here! Suckers! <laughs> There's a totem right there too. I need to remember where this is at. Yeah, these guys are definitely hostile. <laughs> There's three of them right here trying to take me out. I found another one of these rituals. Something to do with Thalmcraft. And then there's something else over here I want to check out, but these guys are kind of... Who's... Aha, ha, you dummy, you're stuck in the quicksand, aren't you? Get this other one over here, too. Come on. You want me so bad? Come here. <laughs> yeah, that one's smart. Maybe. Oh. Uh, come on, come on, a little bit more. Gotcha. No, uh, is he sinking? He's sinking. Sucker. <laughs> I'm just gonna shoot you in the face. Yeah. Does that hurt? You can't do anything about it. 
wait. Is that all of them? There's another one over there. He's gonna. Yeah, he's definitely gonna come back for me. No, he's not. You just stay right there while I dig up your buddy's remains. Uh, uh, uh. Ooh, he dropped something. What is it? Man, I'm running low on juice. 21%. Ooh, void seed. What can I make with that? Nothing. Great. <laughs> Gold coin, me. I'm getting a lot of uh, different types of wood and saplings. Found some birch wood, which will come in handy for the village. Let's cruise over here and see if there's anything over here. Doesn't look like it. There's some water, nothing in there. Is there anything below it? That's the question. Uh, let's just stick some of this. My frick my mouse is doing that stupid crap again. See, like it's just switching items. Why is it doing that? I hate that. That's so annoying. I don't know why it keeps doing that. With that slot right there, why does it do that? Hmm. Makes oh, whoa! Oh crap! Oh crap! Okay, didn't mean to. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Leave me oh no! Get up there! Get up there! I didn't mean to. <laughs> Did not know that would happen. <laughs> Finding a lot of these meteors crashed everywhere. This is Skystone. If I go down and mine right in the middle of it, which takes forever. I mean, this stuff is like obsidian. It takes so long to mine in here. Oh, come on. I'm hoping it's just three levels max. But if I mine down into this thing, I can find a chest, like right in the middle of it. Please not be a lava below me. That would suck. Oh, I guess it's four levels. Come on. Come on, chest. Come on, chest. I found another one while I go. Oh my god, really? Where the heck is the freaking chest at? It's got, oh man. There's definitely lava, like, really close, though. But I found one while I go. And, whoops. Found some good stuff. What did I found? I found these unknown dimlets, which I'm not really sure what I can do with that yet. Dimlet filter, uh, filter dimlets from these. Uh, that's not really telling me much. Dimension monitor, dimlet scrambler. Hmm. So this might be some stuff that we get into later on. But, I mean, I got a bunch of that stuff. I got an inscriber silicon press. This is going to come in handy when I start the AE stuff, which I'm looking forward to. This one, too. What else did I get out of there? I think that's all I got out of there. These amazing Technicolor glasses. Let's see if they... I mean, do they do anything? Whoa, they look cool. Nope, they don't do anything. They just... Whoa, especially with my eyes. Oh, dude, there we go. That looks awesome. Oh, it stopped. There it goes. Yeah. <laughs> Check me out. That's awesome. That is so cool. I like that. <laughs> Alright. Enough of that. Anyway, I'm going to keep going down in here and see if I can find something. It's got to be the last level before there's a chest. If there's a chest at all. I mean, they've all had chests in them so far, so this one has to have a chest, right? Right? Ah, there it is. And it doesn't have anything. Wow. I mean, is there any point to grabbing another one? <clears throat> and I could take that chest. I've got another one back at the base. I'm not going to because it takes four... Oh, well, they stack anyway, so sure, I'll take it. <laughs> So, I'm not going to worry about picking that thing up because it takes way too long to mine. Get rid of those. Lilac, I'll keep it. 
I've also noticed that because of these, uh, what are they? Where, do I have any? Ah, because of these botania flowers, there's no ordinary flowers. There's very few of them, so I'm having trouble getting dye. But luckily, I found some dye trees. But I need to find other colors. So that's another thing I'm on the lookout for out here. And it looks like we found another village. This one looks pretty sweet too. I like how the villages are made in this mod. These would be great vanilla villages. Oh, and there's also a little bit more. Heck yeah, they just annihilated that zombie. There's also these guys right here. Why are you shooting each other? Look at them. They're not very smart, but I mean, they're all over these zombies. How much life do you have left? Can I see? I can't see. This guy... <laughs> Did your wife kick you out, bud? <laughs> what was that? He just got a flew out of there. Yeah, these places are pretty cool. They don't even care, man. They'll just pop a bed up anywhere. Huh? Her? Awesome. Yeah, so I'll have to mark this place, and I might come back here at some point. We'll see. Okay, guys, we're back. And I think that is enough traveling for today. If we look at the map. I've found a lot of villages. So there's one up there. Found a dungeon here. Aura nodes. Village, 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 village. There's another one there that I didn't mark. I have to go back and mark that one. And I think there was a hint of ones. Yeah, oh, yeah, right here. There's one right here. So I have to check that one out too. So I've done quite a bit of exploring. I just made a circle. Pretty much, a little spiral. Found some cool stuff, and my inventory is packed. I found a lot of uh, witchcraft stuff, so I might be getting into some of that. Uh, some mistcraft, which I definitely want to get into that. I need to make a quarry age. And next, I think I will be going to the Nether because I need glowstone. Definitely. And what else? Oh, I'm so glad I brought this flux pack because I've had to recharge this jetpack so many times. So many times. Boots have been somewhat handy. What else? Oh, yeah, I picked up. Yeah, a lot of miscraft stuff. Got my Thaumonomicon, which will come in handy when I start my Thaumcraft. And some more Thaumcraft stuff. What else? What else? What else? What else? A lot of these inscribers. And a bunch of different wood. And a bunch of these unknown dimlets, which I don't even know what that's going to be used for yet. We'll see. But that is definitely enough. I've been exploring for quite a while. I did want to show y'all one thing that is super cheaty. I don't know if you could do it on servers, but I'm in single player, so this may be the only reason I can do this. But you can, let's see, home base, teleport, boom, back at home already. That is so cheaty, <laughs> but it's awesome. Oh, are these done yet? Nope. Close, 86. 86%. Almost got some more ender pearls. But yeah, I think uh I think next episode we'll be going to the Nether because I need some stuff from there. Man, it's going to look so awesome when I do this. And I'll probably do some more work on the on the base on this village off camera. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Hope you see some uh, interesting things. I found a lot of spawners when I was mining too. God, look at all the waypoints. <laughs> that's awesome. Well, that's going to do it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Leave a like, subscribe, share. 
and I will see you guys next time. Peace.